Most of the time, a tracheostomy tube exchange is a planned procedure. You will change out the tube at a set time determined between you and your doctor. However, there will be occasions in which an unplanned emergency tracheostomy tube exchange will be needed. The reasons for this are many. Time will be of the essence. You will need to exchange the tracheostomy tube quickly. With that said, unlike a normal tracheostomy tube exchange, you will take shortcuts during an emergency tracheostomy tube exchange. For more information on how to do a regular tracheostomy tube exchange, please see the video, How to Do a Tracheostomy Exchange at Home. Before beginning the tracheostomy tube exchange, if you have a cuff on your tracheostomy tube, make sure the cuff is deflated. Use a syringe to deflate the cuff. Also, when you need to do an emergency tracheostomy tube exchange, you will never know where you may be. It is best to wash your hands with soap and water and dry them thoroughly. However, if a sink is not available, hand sanitizer will work. If you do not have hand sanitizer, skip cleaning your hands. It is better to get the trach tube exchanged and the person breathing than to take precious time to try to find a sink and clean one's hands. Usually, during a tracheostomy tube exchange, you will replace the trach tube holder with a new one. However, during an emergency tracheostomy tube exchange, reuse the old trach tube holder if possible. If your trach tube holder has Velcro, Simply unfasten the Velcro and leave the trach tube holder around the person's neck. If your trach tube holder has string which needs to be tied around the person's neck, you will have to cut the trach tube tie before exchanging the trach tube. After exchanging the trach tube, you will need to tie a new trach tube string around the person's neck to secure the tracheostomy tube. Thank you so much for joining me. Please remember to like and subscribe down below. I hope you have a great day and a wonderful week. Bye-bye.